It's, I mean, it's a real bottom line impact that these companies are going to have, and it's going to be what do they choose to do with the money? Is it going to be reinvestment, buybacks, dividends, uh, mergers and acquisitions, combination of the sorts? Um, I, I'm expecting a lot of uh, buybacks to occur. I think that might be option one. What I want to see, I want to see a lot of companies clean up their balance sheet, open them up to future opportunities, especially when the future may be a little un uh, uncertain years from now. Um, but I mean, look at waste management, prime example. We talked about this just before. They had a huge um, uh, price target raised yesterday off of tax reform, what it's going to do to their free cash flows. So I think a lot of these companies, domestic based, they're going to have real real impacts to their stocks. Are there any stocks in the portfolio that you think would engage in M&A activity in 2018? Yeah, so we own, we own Honeywell. Um, I, I don't think it will be a direct result from tax reform because their balance sheet's already pretty clean, but they are spinning off their non-core assets later in the year. Um, they might want to bulk up their core positions this year by going out in the market and beefing up aerospace, for example. So that's one option.